What's up, guys? This is your boy Rusun, and I'm just waiting for the infidels to shut the fuck up. So, well, guys, welcome to I Love Bad Movies. Uh, but before I even try to explain to you guys what I Love Bad Movies is, uh, I need to first thank you all. Um, I know if you look at the number of subscribers I have right now uh, and that I had last month, the number seems to be the same. But I do know that even if numbers may say that, there has been a change, has been an increase. And the reason for that is you guys being subscribing, you guys being hitting the notifications bell. And the way I know that is I've been losing subscribers, but every time I actually check how I lost the subscribers, pretty much 90% of them have been closed accounts. It's something that is going on on YouTube right now. Um, a lot of people that subscribe to channels, they're also YouTubers, even if small ones and you know, three strikes are out. So it happens. Uh, people lose accounts. Now, anyway, I am working on a lot of projects. I had put a hold. One of them is I Love Bad Movies. So, what is I Love Bad Movies? Look, the way I see, uh, if you look at Hollywood and all that stuff, it's uh, been kind of dodgy lately. Um, Hollywood right now, their eyes have been in the Chinese market. Nothing wrong with that, but the moment that they start changing some movies, some uh, some of their stories to be able to please everybody, I feel that movies have been losing a lot. And in the other side, you have uh, a lot of people that actually get money for a movie to be made. Uh, and I feel like a lot of directors, a lot of actors, a lot of writers, sometimes they just don't care about movies anymore. Uh, a lot of times it becomes more of uh, just get a movie out, so there's no so. Uh, it's pretty much like carbon copy of another movie, but not well made. So I'm gonna be looking at that. Now, why do I love those bad movies? Well, um, like for example, the first movie I'm gonna be covering, uh, probably ne by next week I should have the video done, is uh, Dinosaur Planet or Dinosaur Galaxy. And trust me, it's actually not a bad movie to be watched. Yeah. And I would say because most actors, but for one, the movie is actually fairly good. And I will actually be going through the movie, uh, some scenes and debating some really, really, really bad decisions they are made. Uh, some really mess ups that pretty much tell me that the director was like, <clears throat> don't care. Because some things that, and I'll show you guys, but that even I can fix in a few minutes, and they just laughed on the movie. Um, yeah, so we're gonna be looking at those things. We're gonna debate a little bit about some actors that, you know, they gave them all when they had a really, really bad movie to play. But you know, and you're a new actor, you don't have choices. You take whatever they offer you and you try to make a name for yourself. Or a lot of times really good movies that maybe the CGI, if that was 1998, would have been good. But that's why when Alien was made, they James Cameron pretty much said, you know, uh, we didn't have a high budget, so we rarely showed the Alien. Look at that, less is more, right? Anyway, so, so that's the kind of stuff we're going to be debating with movies. I'm going to try to cover movies that Maybe even if they made money, uh, people kind of forgot they even exist. I, I think those movies have to be remembered, mostly because uh, I know people that have never watched Back to the Future, Bill and Ted, and movies like this, so that's the kind of stuff I'm going to be covering. Also some newer movies, like Dinosaur Galaxy or Planet, that, you know, it, it was made. Now, I know you, has, you guys have been noticing, I've been playing a lot with uh, the colors on the videos. I've been actually starting to use log profile, what 
I'm still on the side if I'm gonna keep doing that. Uh, I'm working on it. So, uh, I have everything from some new frames showing up on the channel, uh, different thumbnails, different projects that I have, I had put on hold. If you guys notice, the other thing is there are not many cuts right now on my videos when I talk. And look, I, I used to have a lot of cuts because I do have PTSD. It, it is kind of complicated for me to talk directly to the camera. Um, one of the things is you guys help a lot with your comments. I feel like I'm talking to friends and talk to people I actually know instead of just to a little lance in there. Um, the other thing that helps you is I'm trying to be more myself. Um, I think for a long time on YouTube, I tried to be extremely professional, what is not a bad thing, but sometimes you kind of uh, miss who you are. Uh, I'd be more worried about my appearance, uh, vitiligo, all those things, and how people are gonna see. And you know what? That's who I am. And I hope most of you guys like it. And if you like it, smash the like button. You know, subscribe. Hit the notifications bell, leave a comment, you know what I mean. Um, I may actually start to get more into social media uh, to be able to interact with people. It's it, it's stuff that I avoided during my time in in the army. Um, do have a Facebook page. I actually do have a broke not dead page on Facebook that I actually don't use as much um, because I feel like it, it, it becomes just too clustered too, too many random people that don't even know the channel just just randomly go in and try to sell you something but I'm working on those things anyway guys uh, I just want to talk about this and give a little update on what's going on the channel um, would love your input what do you guys like the best? Uh, what you saw in the la latest videos? It, what I should keep doing? What I should maybe remove? You guys don't like a show or another? Maybe with time I'll just transition to its own channel. But I really don't think it's a good idea right now because I need to focus on BND. I do have a kind of channel, BND Brazil, but it, it's pretty much when I have time I make videos because I really should not be taken out of our regular channel. So yeah, I'm trying to beat YouTube right now because a lot of changes have been happening and um, I used to get my videos shown a lot more than they used than right now because YouTube seems to want me to put videos almost every day and I know I've been doing every week or every two weeks so I'm changing those things right now I am going back probably tomorrow with uh, streaming of Doom it just takes a little bit of time for me uh, to set up stream sometimes I have some issues and you know but anyway guys, thanks for watching, again, don't forget to do all those things I always ask you guys to. Hope you guys have a nice weekend, and as always, I'll see you in the game.